So here we are today doing a solar roof. This is our first one with GAF. We are GAF solar certified. We talked to Tesla, we talked to GAF. We actually were vetting with Tesla for a little bit and after the things that we kind of saw with their products, there was just a lot of night and day comparisons to how much better GAF solar product is and it's impact resistant, it's flush to the, to the roof, the whole inboarding process with the electrical, and it just makes sense. We have that great partnership with them with our shingles as well, doing the Golden Pledge warranties on all of our roofs. And now we get to do certified installs with solar and still add the Golden Pledge warranty to the roofs at the same time. They're not raised and mounted. They literally, you nail them in just like you nail a shingle, so it flows a lot better. It gives it a better look to where you're not feeling like you're driving by somebody's house that has something raised four inches off their house. You've got all these possibility of leaks when you use the raised panels compared to these flat panels. The old version, uh, you have to pretty much screw to the deck and, and then screw over shingles. So you're creating a penetration that, you know, any penetration with time and the roof will leak eventually. The other part that I like is it adapts to every roof. As me 20 years as a roofer, I haven't seen a, a perfect roof yet. Even new construction is not level. So this adapts to all that. I know our competition, they have the system that is so precise that it won't adapt to all the roofs. So that will create an issue. They test it for hail damage and stuff like that. So it, it, I think it rated to half an inch of hail. You could walk on it, you could jump on it, you could step on it. I don't know why you will decide for a regular roof now that you have a possibility that a roof that gives you money, that a roof that doesn't give you money. If you're getting a roof because of insurance and it's $20,000 to spend on getting a, the solar panels, but you're getting a 50% offset, so more than likely in less than eight years you paid for your solar roof with the uh, money you saved on your electric. This is definitely an option that you should look into.